Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you can't already tell by my voice, yes, I caught a cold here in Japan. And what I wanted to do for you guys today was to share with you all the favorite items that I have been loving when I was sick and what I have been going back to to help me recover. And yeah, let's get right into it. The first thing I have surprisingly been loving are face masks like I was actually really surprised how much I grew to love this now back home in Canada this isn't really the norm I actually thought that people who use this were a little bit weird or they kind of look scary but now that I come here and it's so normal to just wear it when you're sick it's actually um one to prevent you from getting sick to to stop the germs and just to kind of be really considerate about others around you so yeah i have been going through packs of these the last week and a half uh this does come in a pack of seven they do come in a pack of three uh if you're smart and you get a pack of 40 then yeah you're smart <laughs> but um yeah sometimes actually let me in you on a little hack uh, you would uh, sometimes like when I don't feel really well or when I just want to go out and I don't want to wear makeup I just kind of like put this on my face and you can't really tell that I'm not wearing any makeup You just do your eyebrows pop them on and uh, go out the door like no one can really tell so Yeah, I've been really loving masks lately and um, yeah I do masks the next thing I'm going to be talking about are these cooling compression sheets for your forehead. So you just kind of pop them on like this. And this one says it'll keep you cool for up to 10 hours. Now this is obviously used for fevers. So you just kind of stick that on and it'll keep your head from exploding. Just kidding, it'll <laughs> keep your head cool. You can actually also use this on muscle pain as well. And I just find this really useful, um, especially if you work on the computer a lot and your eyes get sore or your head gets really sore, you can just kind of pop that on. And the cooling effect is really relaxing. It does miracle wonders. And yeah, probably going to bring this back home with me because it's the bomb. So yeah. The next item I wanted to talk about were these heating packs. Yes. So... I, there are the stick-on types. I just didn't get these stick-on types, which is really dumb of me. But I usually use this when I'm feeling cold or I have body chills or body aches. Uh, yeah, this type actually keeps you warm for up to 20 hours. Now, I don't know how it does that, but Japan seems to make it work. So, yeah, thank you for that too. Now, one thing I forgot to bring here with me from Canada were my vitamins. And I was really dumb to forget my vitamins because vitamins are life. But luckily for Japan, they have these jelly vitamin supplements. Now, I don't know how they thought of this, but they did. And basically, like... You can get any type of vitamin, any type of flavor, whatever floats your boat. Like, this one is vitamin lemon, and it has vitamin C, obviously, and it has 50-something of whatever that is. But you can get vitamins A, B, C, D, E, and all different types of flavors. And it's not a juice, it's a jelly. So basically, when you think of your jelly desserts or jello in a little bottle form and a more liquid consistency that's what this is but it's actually good for you so yeah this has really been saving my life since i forgot my vitamins so highly recommend yes the one thing i don't like about being sick are the cough drops or cough candies that i have to constantly take when i'm not home taking medicine it's because they taste really gross and like they they just don't taste really nice but Japan found a way to make cough drops taste decent not amazing but decent and these ones are the VC 3000 
obviously by the title it has a vitamin C and this one actually has uh, vitamins B1 and B2 this is the lemon flavor and I've been really enjoying these these actually have a really good review among people online living in Japan all the gaijins they love this so I've been loving this a whole lot because I just go through four of these a day when I need them so thanks VC one drink I've been loving, loving, loving so much this entire time that I've been sick. Green dakara. I don't know why, but I just go through two bottles of these a day. Like, this is basically vitamin water, but it tastes better. And it's, you know, vitamin water. It's good for you. <laughs> it has, what does it have in here? It has lemon, orange uh kiwi grapefruit and tomato is this kiwi let's just pretend that green fruit is kiwi but yeah i've been going through bottles and bottles of these i actually recommend getting the really big bottle it does save you more money the big bottle costs around 120 yen while this small bottle if you get it at the convenience store it's about 100 yen but got a little sip for you, go to the supermarket. It costs around 60 yen. So that's where I've been going to to getting my bottles of green dakara. So yeah, guys, uh, go green or go home. And now the moment of truth, cold medicine. Thank you, Benza Block S. That's all I should say, but I will say more. Uh, Benza Block S, these are your go-to cold medicine that I would recommend. They come in, they have a whole Benza block line. The yellow one is specifically for colds that start from the nose. You can tell with the picture over here if it'll focus. So yeah, uh, for like runny nose and like congested nose, that's what I have. So that's why I grabbed this. Um, the other Benza block ones there is a blue one i believe for ones that are for uh your throat or is it for your head i believe it's for your head and the other one i think it's a silver one that's for your throat i'll write it down in the description below but yeah this has really been saving my life and thank you benza block s love you long time so guys, that wraps up my sick day haul, I guess. I hope you guys learned something about being sick in Japan or dealing with how to be sick in Japan. And yeah, hopefully I get better soon so I can make more videos for you guys. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. So bye guys.